Hey everybody, this is Martin from Contentful. I'm just going to quickly describe how to set up the optional slug feature in the Gatsby Cloud app. So as you can see here, I've defined a series of content types using these dropdowns. <clears throat> and then next to the content types, there is this field to optionally define slugs. And so what that means is when you've defined a slug, it will append that slug to your base site URL for each entry. And so there's two ways to define slugs. First, you can use a static string by surrounding whichever input you give uh, with quotes. And so what this will do is append events to the base site URL for every entry under the events entry content type. So let's just go give this a try really quick. As you can see, these are events entry entries in Contentful. Let's open one of these up. Oh, before I do that, I just need to save this really quickly. And I'm just going to refresh my entry quick. Perfect. And so as you can see, I'm running this in a test environment. So it's called get test. I'm just going to open my preview here. Here we have the base URL and events appended to it. Go back, select another entry. Open preview, base URL, events appended. So just to reiterate, <clears throat> for each one of the events entries, entries, the entries under the content type events entry, it will append the string events to the base URL. The other thing you can use is dot notation to access a field on the content entry for a content type. So I'm going to use essentials.slug. Oops, I didn't need to go out of that. Open this back up. And so as you can see, I have this essentials reference. And then within the essentials reference, I have a slug field. And so what this should do is append the static string events backslash whatever the value of my essentials.slug field is to the preview button. First, however, I need to save that. Open the preview. And as you can see, we have the static events and then the value of the field. <clears throat> Let's try that for one more entry. Blueprints and Mia. Open preview. Same thing. Static event string dot notation value of the field. The only thing to add is that you can add as many sections to your slug as you want, as long as they're separated by backslashes. And you can also go as many reference levels deep as you want using dot notation. So as you can see up here, I have a field called test within that field. Test is another field essentials and within essentials is finally getting slug. So you can use as many levels of references as you want to define your slug. So that's it. And I hope you enjoy using Gatsby Cloud.